Welcome to FHA Connection, Applying for Certification. This video is the first of two in our FHA Connection series. This video is for housing counselors who have just passed the HUD Housing Counselor Certification Exam. Congratulations on passing your exam. Please note the following important message. The coordinator cannot be the same person currently registered in the Line of Credit Control System or the Web Access Security Subsystem nor can the coordinator currently act as the FHA lender coordinator for the agency. The Housing Counseling Final Rule defines a HUD certified housing counselor as someone who has passed the certification exam and is employed by a HUD approved housing counseling agency. Now that you have passed the exam, it is time to apply for certification in HUD system, FHA Connection. In this video, we will also refer to FHA Connection as FHAC. This video is the first of two in our FHA Connection series. Please note, this video describes the process for those who have never applied for certification before and do not already have an FHA Connection ID. If you are already a HECM roster counselor or an application coordinator who already has an FHA Connection ID, do not follow the process in this video. Please go directly to the Request Validation for more than one employer or branch page on the HUD Exchange for instructions on how to request validation for an additional employer, including if you have switched agencies and need your new agency to validate you. There are two steps in applying for certification. 1. Transfer your exam results to FHA Connection. 2. Complete the HUD Certified Housing Counselor application. The first step after passing the exam is to transfer your results to FHA Connection. It is important to double check that your name, email, social security number, agency HCS ID, and other information are correct before transferring your results. After transferring your results, the second step is to go to the HUD Certified Housing Counselor application page on FHA Connection. Select Certified in the Counselor Type drop-down. Click OK to close the pop-up warning. Fill in all fields. To find your agency HCS ID, ask your program manager or search in HUD's HCA lookup tool. To find your counselor exam ID, visit your profile page on www.hudhousingcounselors.com. Please note that applying for certification is a one-time step. Once complete, the system automatically submits your employment validation request. If you work for multiple agencies, you may add additional agencies after you register and receive your FHAC user ID. Once you have double-checked that all information is accurate, click Send. If your application is successful, you will see a success message at the top of the page. The agency selects the FHAC application coordinator. The coordinator's purpose is to validate the counselor's employment at the agency and to manage the data regarding the counselor's employment status in the future. Let your agency's FHAC application coordinator know that you successfully submitted your employment validation request. If you do not know who this person is, please contact your agency manager. The next step is to request an FHAC user ID, which is covered in Part 2. Sometimes, an application does not go through because of an error. If your application is not successful, an error message will appear. Click Review Errors to read what type of error has happened. Resolve the error using the instructions on the screen. If the error message says that your exam ID or social security number are incorrect, or cannot be found, please verify that you entered the correct information. If you have entered the correct information in FHA Connection but are still receiving an error message, contact www.hudhousingcounselors.com to ensure that the correct social security number was used when transferring your exam results. If you are still unable to resolve your error message, please contact the HUD Exchange Ask a Question portal. After you have successfully submitted your application for certification, the next step is to request an FHA Connection user ID. Please check out Part 2 of this video for assistance. Remember, you are not finished with the process just yet.